What's up, peoples? It's a terraformer. <laughs> Playing Shining Star, still getting used to that analog Z, L thing, whatever. I actually had to look up where the, um, <laughs> where the course one is because I didn't remember. Oh god. <laughs> this, <laughs> this port. I really wish he'd change the music for this version, but I mean, I kind of understand as well because he's making a new version, but he's also using different songs, and see, the thing with that is I feel like some of the songs are pretty memorable, actually. This level is one of those levels where you kind of run in circles around and get confused as to what part of the level is, even though it's not really that big or anything. Especially compared to other levels that I'm thinking about have this... I, I don't know if it's a problem of myself or... This song is gonna get really bad, by the way. Just, eh, yeah, this fight is bad. <laughs> I don't know why, it's just like the way that they're placed, the distance between each other. Same that there's a lot or anything. Yeah, right right there, that's that's fantastic. <laughs> Let's just come over here, buddy, for the final hit. So I don't have to worry about fire when the star is spawning and stuff. I, I have fought a lot worse of these before, but... Well, they're, they're always kind of special. Oh, that's... bad. Uh, I'm dead. There is nothing I can do about that. <sighs> oh, come on. There we go. But I'm... Eh. Damn it. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure that this hack was made before 1-2 Oatmeal became popular. I'm sure it existed, but like, people weren't like, oh, 1-2 Oatmeal, yeah, that's my jam. It just, it was a song that a few people knew of, I'm sure, but... And then Dr. Mario, I can do the tricks. I can on. It's a it's a very it's a lyrically genius song. I'm pretty sure I don't even know the words, which is cool. But you know who actually knows the words to songs like these? They're just too high of IQ to understand. Ugh. So. <laughs> Secrets, I tend to always miss one, which I'm pretty sure they're just always out in the open. But, like I said, this level... I don't know. I didn't go to this level first because of the way the overworld is set up. I don't want to mess with that. That that has softlock written all over it. I'm not even going to call it the other term coined by someone who isn't me, or someone I really watch anymore, but kind of got, yeah, I got a little overused, you know? See, and then there, there's a little more. But there's a star over there, and a star here. Should I just make sure that that's not a star? I, I don't know. Might be like, just behind the thing? Does this have a behind? No. It, it just goes to the wall. I actually think it's up here. I, I don't know why, but... Like, when you have a clear theme for a thing, and then you just put it over here for some reason... I, I mean, I hope. Because I, this always happens. Yeah, it's just right up there. But... I don't know. I, I can't really be too harsh on it. It is Vi's first hack, after all, and I do find enough quality to it for it to be played on YouTube, but there is some things that are just... yeah.
Yes, and this is the star, as I said before. And it's just right over here. Sometimes little quick stars like that are nice. It's like the original game, really. And Zatar Attack rebooted by also by Agla. Which But I'm not going to be able to see it, because it's one of those. I remember having quite a lot of difficulty here, especially here because in the original version these would not come back. But since then, K's has made new ones, so that they come back after a while, and they should be in this one. Yeah, I remember taking a long time for coins as well. Like I started to say, I don't think I finished it, but the way the overworld is set up and you just kind of spawn by courses 3 and 4 or 4 and 5 or whatever, it's it's very easy to be like, huh, where's the other, where's the other levels? Which actually is even worse in this one hack. I've been playing a bit, the Unknown Stars, and with with that hack, basically the first levels you're gonna find are like 13 and 12 and 11, which, um, I think there is a course 14, but it's listed as like the slide, so it doesn't have a star select screen. I don't think there's a course 15. But, yeah, it's just a really weird way to do a hack, but it is different, so, I mean, credit there, I guess. <laughs> I think these might have been moved, too. I feel like they were even more awkward than that. But then again, this was one of the early hacks I played. I, yeah, I saw it, I'll get it. It's the last star, and I... I shouldn't really be getting stars out of order like this, it's just, it doesn't go right with the flow. Yeah. <laughs> Almost, but it didn't really matter that they come back, because I was able to get to them in time. A lot of my time spent on this level too was looking for the entrance to this mountain. And just running around it in circles. It's pretty great. But yeah, that was actually Course 1. In the fourth video, we finally went to Course 1. And, yep, that, <laughs> that went. So, I guess shorter videos will be the trend for now. I'm sure closer to later on will be longer. We got that. I think that's Course 2. And then and course three, course four, course five is up there, and you need a certain amount of stars. It's like kind of open though. <laughs> oh, the blocks just didn't spawn. I'm sure you could just jump in there if that wasn't the case. Yeah, that'll, that'll be a video. Oh, there is another level. There's two levels over there. Very, very important to just observe this crafted overworld. Say goodbye.